Hey everyone, what is going on? And welcome back to another showcase in the Halloween Cup. So we are taking a look at a really cool team. And this trainer actually said they went 21-0 and with this team. So we're taking a look at the final set. Unfortunately, they didn't submit uh, the whole 21 and oh, run. that would have been really nice. But either way, we're taking a look at the final set. Uh, we have Kafagrigus with Shadow Drapion and Shadow Gramble in the back. So Kafagrigus is not a Pokemon that I've actually seen yet in the Halloween Cup, at least this rotation. So very cool nonetheless. Um, and yeah, I mean, it's another ghost type that is a pretty cool Pokemon. Of course, it does well against Needle Queen. Uh, well, not when that Earth Power <laughs> lands, I guess, but it did get a shield at least. Uh, Shadow Drapion is coming in now. Going to be able to go for this Crunch Attack. This probably doesn't KO the Needle Queen, but you could probably farm down afterwards. But they do actually commit the shield. The next one should KO the Needle Queen, though, uh, because, I mean, they did get the debuff. So we're going to see a shield right there. Uh, and we're going to see this attack come in right now, and this is going to be enough. I uh, should be enough to KO again with the debuff. I imagine it would be uh, as it is. So very nice, able to KO that. Has a shield advantage. In comes a Zumel. This is not bad because this Shadow Drapion does have Sludge Bomb. So this is really solid. He has Sludge Bomb is coming out. Going to be doing a lot. Not enough to KO, but that's okay. Do you shield this? Yep, they're going to go ahead and shield this one. So it's going to be an Ice Beam. It would be nice for the Drapion to farm down, but I don't know if they're going to be able to. Yeah, I guess not, but the opponent pulls a really nice switch. I didn't see what came in, but whatever it is, going to be hit with the crunch. Okay, Vileplume, that's not bad, actually. Uh, in comes Gramble. Gramble going to be able to charm down. It almost goes down, though. Look how much damage it did. But one more charm will pick up the knockout on the Azu, and that is going to be a great game. Very well played to both trainers in that one, but able to win that. You love to see it. Let's go ahead and move into the next one. Kafagrigus into Scizor right now. Okay. Um, the Night Slash is a problem. I've been seeing a lot of Scizor leads. Like, I saw a lot today. Let me know if you've been seeing a lot of Scizor leads. It's a great Pokemon, so, like, I, I understand it. But, yeah, I've just been seeing so many. Uh, but, anyway, we're going to see a Shadow Ball with the Kafagrigus that will pick up the shield. Um, they're going to be able to throw a Night Slash, which will KO the Kafagrigus. Do you let this go? Do you shield it? Going to go ahead and shield it, just so the Kafagrigus can get to another Shadow Ball. Uh, and they're going to be able to get to it, so this is going to KO, or more than likely, going to pick up a shield from the Scizor. No, they let it go, okay. So they want to get ahead on energy with the Skunk Tank, okay. So Skunk Tank will get ahead on energy. In comes Drapion. So... This is good because you don't want that Poison Jab user on the Gramble, right? So I'm going to go ahead and take this. Uh, so we're going to see a Crunch come in right now. Of course, these moves are both resisted, which is unfortunate. But, uh, I mean, you'd rather have this on this Skunk Tank, as I said, than the Gramble, right? So we're going to see another Crunch come in. Uh, and they are going to shield that one up. So trying to get to one more... Gonna let it go. Okay, so gonna let it go and probably get ahead on energy with the Shadow Gramble. Yes, Shadow Gramble will take a lot, but it will also farm down and, as I said, get ahead on energy. Oh, in comes Alolan Ninetales. Needs to get to the close combat. Oh, man, unfortunately, the Ninetales cannot get to it. So that is where the, the win streak ended. I believe they said it was a 21 uh, game win streak. I could be wrong. I think they said 21 game win streak. But either way, we're going to finish off the set, of course. So Kafagrigus into Crustal. Crustal is going to go ahead and catch uh, the Shadow Ball. So let's see what they caught it on. Uh, going to be a Mana Buzz. So beautiful catch by the opponent there. But in comes Gramble. Gramble will be able to successfully farm this down. Not before an attack comes in. Uh, so this Gramble will be hit with an Aerial Ace for sure. Going to be neutral damage. Doing a good amount as well, Gramble, especially the Shadow variant, is really, really frail. Uh, so very nice. It comes Jellicent, able to make it to a crunch. you love to see that. So this crunch is super effective damage. And we do see a shield, uh, so Gramble goes down. At least able to get that shield. Gonna go ahead and bring in the Kafagrigus right now. Uh, this is, this is iffy. Do you shield this? I don't know. We're gonna see a shield. Uh, it is gonna be a Shadow Ball, so that's a nice shield. I wonder if I would've put into Drapion. Uh, just because you know that Drapion resists Shadow Ball, right? And of course, Bubble Beam isn't gonna be doing much. Ice Beam would be neutral. Uh, but in comes the Drapion against the Crystal. Uh, so Crystal is gonna go ahead and go for this attack right now. We're gonna see a shield right now. So very nice. Uh, and now we're going to see this attack come in. This is gonna be a Crunch. So this is going to be a hard-hitting move, doing a lot of damage, going to be able to farm down. 
yeah, going to be able to... F no, well, I mean, the opponent backs out. So that's going to be a great game. Very well played to both trainers and able to win that one. Let's go ahead and move into the next battle. Going to be a Kafagrigus into a Crustle. So we do see another Crustal. Uh, so let's see what happens. Uh, is the Crystal going to switch out? We'll see. They're not going to be able to catch the Shadow Ball this time. Not this trainer. The Shadow Ball is coming out. Uh, going to be doing a lot of damage. So much damage. Shield Farm down. Or just let it go. Okay, if it's an X, is a, that is a great call. Rock Slide would do a lot. Oh, is that Rock Blast? I think that was Rock Blast. Not doing too much. Kafagrigus will be able to farm down. You'll love to see it. Uh, in comes Drapion. Of course, Drapion will be resisting these attacks. But we're going to see a Dog Pulse come in. And this Dark Pulse will get the shield, and we're going to see the Drapion switch in right now. Uh, so the attack is coming in from the opponent's Drapion. Uh, going to be a crunch, not doing too much damage. We do see a debuff though, which is a little bit unfortunate, but that's okay. Uh, Drapion is going to go ahead and go for this crunch right now. Uh, trying to get to one more, the opponent will get to it. This is not going to KO, shouldn't KO even. Uh, okay, even with the debuff, but we do see a shield anyway. Um, so wanting to stay a little bit healthy, this Drapion will be able to go for this crunch right now. Uh, so that's totally fine. Doing a good amount of damage as well, the opponent will go ahead and go for an attack. This might KO the Drapion, let's see. Or well, it might get it very low. It doesn't KO, but it does get it very low. Oh, Poison Sting down! Able to Poison Sting down, comes out with energy. Is that in the Lola Ninetales? Well, unfortunately, the crunch is gonna go ahead and go into it. Uh, it is in the Lola Nine Tails, but hey, still picking up a shield. In comes Gramble. Uh, Gramble should be fine here. Just, I mean, it has to shield. Uh, oh, they're not going to shield. Okay, that does not KO. Um, and trying to get to a crunch, the opponent will throw another attack. So at least they throw an attack. The Gramble will be going down. Um, so in comes this Kafagrigus. Kafagrigus should be able to win this now. So they're going to go ahead and shield this and just Shadow Claw down. Maybe they'll make it to an attack, but either way, it doesn't matter. Uh, that's actually a Powder Snow Ninetales. At first, I thought it was Charm, but it's actually Powder Snow. Um, so we're going to see the Alola Ninetales go down, and that is going to be a great game. Very well played to both trainers. Absolutely incredible. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and move into the final, final battle of this video. Kafagrigus into Drift Blim. Um, I mean, not too bad. Not the greatest. I mean, not the greatest, but the Shadow Claws are doing a lot of damage. We're going to be doing, uh, or we're going to be seeing the Shadow Ball come in. Uh, that will get the shield. Um, okay, going to go ahead and catch. Oh, did they catch the Shadow Ball? What do you guys think? Uh... <clears throat> Excuse me, I feel like it's an icy win, but no, it's actually a Shadow Ball, so that is a beautiful catch. Uh, this is an icy win. Do you shield this? Nope, gonna go ahead and let it go. Gonna be an icy win, that's fine. So the crunch is coming in into this Drift Blim right now. So that will KO it, very nice. So in comes Toxic Croak. Okay, that is amazing. That is amazing. Gonna bring in Gramble. Uh, yeah, I mean, could have brought in either one, honestly. Uh, you do have to shield this attack because Sludge Bomb will KO. Even a Mud Bomb will do a lot. Kafagrigus, uh, I mean, the counters are double resisted, you know, and in comes Umbreon, yeah. So this is a great game. Uh, so, yeah, this is going to be a good game. This Gramble is absolutely going to town. We're going to see a crunch right now. Going for the defense drop. Uh, we do see a shield, and, I mean, they basically had the shield. Gramble is going to go ahead and shield. Uh, so this is going to be uh, this is going to be totally fine. That is going to be uh, psychic, and the opponent will just uh, give up. Yep. So down goes Umbreon. Very nice. And did the opponent back out or anything? I mean, uh, maybe the opponent uh, force quit the app. I don't know. Sometimes when that happens, it means they force quit. I don't really know, but either way, it doesn't really matter. Great games. Very well played. Thank you so much for sharing your battles with us. I really do appreciate that. Uh, rank 15, gonna get to rank 16, you'll love to see it. Good luck uh, getting to rank uh, 20 so you can get the pose and the outfit. Everything really cool like that. And I'll see you all in the next one. Have a good day. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.